you know. And I'm when this woman, it, we'll call Jennifer, walked out of the salon, this is how her eyebrows looked. It looked great. We were happy. I was happy. What Jennifer had done is called microblading. It involved a hand tool with tiny needles to make shallow little cuts on the skin. Then the pigment seeps in, giving you semi-permanent results. Basically, it gives the appearance of hair on your eyebrows. Instead of regular tattooing, okay. this makes your eyebrows look like you actually have hair. But then the redness started setting in. A few days after, I noticed that they were starting to get like little lumps in it. The pain began to increase and the swelling. Going to urgent care, they diagnosed me with cellulitis on my face and gave me an antibiotic and sent me on my way. But the situation kept getting worse. Jennifer took daily photos to document. She decided to head to the emergency room. When they admitted me, they put me on an IV antibiotic. And then the next morning, they started me on um, steroids. Jennifer spent three days in the hospital. I was terrified. I was terrified. I didn't, you know, my face is swelling up, my eyes are closing. I'm thinking, I don't know what's going to happen. I'm, Hi. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? It looks a little better. Huh. So you're putting on the cream? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think it's better. For the past week, Jennifer has been seeing dermatologist Good Dr. Stephen Grecken for treatment. This is potentially life-threatening if not treated because what's right behind here? Sinuses. What do the sinuses communicate? Boom, they go right to the brain. Might be hard to tell, but things are improving. So why did this occur? There are a lot of variables in this case. So is the patient allergic to the ink that they actually tattoo you with? That's number one. Is she allergic to something that they use to prep the skin? Did she get an infection by being told not to wash her face for two days? She does, though, have mounting medical I mean, bills I, and missed days from work. I, now I regret going in there and getting it done, but it is vanity. Mm -hmm. You want to look good, and you don't ever think that's going to happen to you. Dr. Grecken's advice for those trying to get eyebrows like this through microblading? I think it's buyer beware. I think you have to do your research. I think you have to have multiple visits to make certain that you're comfortable, that the place is clean, it's efficiently run, that this is not taken as sort of a cavalier come in and, and, and get your eyebrows waxed. 